Hi, my name's Alan Cates. I was born in Arlington, uh, graduated from Arlington High School in 1963. When I got married, I bought a house in Arlington. I've lived here all of my life. My wife and I have raised uh, two children here, and we like the town a great deal. We've been very happy to live here, and we think it's a great place to live. Uh, we've been involved in the community. Uh, I've served as chair of the Allenton Boys and Girls Club Board, Sims Hospital, Zoning Board of Appeals. Uh, participated and supported local charities, and we have supported building campaigns to preserve the community, starting with uh, rebuilding the Interterrian Church, which had a terrible fire in 1975. We contributed to capital campaigns to the Boys and Girls Club, to the hospital, uh, to the Robbins Library, um, and to our synagogue. Uh, we are believers in progressive policies. We have voted against, starting in 1980, when we voted against Prop 2 and a half, which we thought was a terrible idea. Uh, we support uh, affordable housing. We think it helps can maintain the diversity that's established in the town. Um, we just don't think this is a good way to fund affordable housing. Affordable housing, if, if we value it, we need to fund it with a more regular supply, not from sales of houses. Uh, we're 70 years old. We lived in the same house for almost 50 years. Uh, if we believe in affordable housing, we could have contributed, and if, if the town decides that how the real estate taxes are the way to do it, uh, they should impose a larger real estate tax. They should not wait for someone who's selling their house uh, to fund this. We need more money for affordable housing. So it, in, in conclusion, I would say that I would hope that you would vote against this article and that you would consider ways to uh, more adequately fund affordable housing in the community that we all find so desirable. Uh, we should not limit it to receipt of revenue on sporadic sales of real estate, but rather funded on an ongoing basis in adequate amounts. And I would urge you to do that.